data of readmissions that really spurred on these readmission penalties. Within 30 days, where the, the, the kind of the penalty phase is currently set, almost 20% of the patients with chronic conditions in this look-see at this data were getting readmitted within 30 days. And in fact, when you look at those patients over 90 days, it was one-third of those patients uh, that were getting readmitted within 90 days of a previous hospitalization. When you look in a full calendar year, it's over half of those patients that are, end up getting readmitted into the hospital setting. So we know the first round of penalties came out and it looked at congestive heart failure, it looked at pneumonia, and it looked at myocardial infarction because those were three of the biggest admission and readmission uh, diagnoses that caused these penalties to go into place. But we know shortly thereafter it was followed by one, not that pneumonia is not near and dear to the respiratory therapist's uh, heart because it uh, is a respiratory condition, but it comes from a various uh, different uh, etiologies, if you will. But one very near and dear to our heart was COPD.